Ladies and gents, welcome back to another AutoCAD tutorial and today I will be teaching you how to add furniture in AutoCAD because you know you don't want to have a bedroom without a bed that does not make no sense but before we get into the video please like, comment, share and subscribe and without further delay let's get into it now let's just use this blank AutoCAD page as our area that we're gonna want our furniture so first what we're going to do is type in add center ad and then center it's going to come up the word is going to come up then you're going to click on it and then there's going to be a page like this that appears afterwards you want to click on n us so the en dash us that's what you're going to click in now you're going to see dynamic blocks and design center click on design center after clicking on design center you're going to see this these are other applications where you can find screws and so on but now you want to have furniture so what we're going to do is click on house design and then after going in house design you're going to click on blocks because that's where the other the furnitures are so click on blocks and this is where you have your furnitures you have your bathtub you have chimney you have your doors you have um windows and when you're doing this you're going to know which furniture you need based on the, any elevation that you're doing any floor plan that you're doing but as for now i'm going to use the sink as an example so i'm going to double click on the sink and i'm going to wait for the dialog box to appear this dialog box um shows that you can uh, you can adjust it you can put it at a different angle unit and the factors and any of that but i'm going to leave it as is so i'm going to select okay so after selecting okay you're going to move your cursor over the screen and click and that's how you release your furniture so i'm going to exit this off and zoom up a little bit more so you guys can see properly that is our sink and that's how you get your furniture i'm going to go over this one more time in case anyone didn't catch it so we're going to go again to add center type add center and then the dialog box will appear because we're just in this dialog box this is the one that's going to appear but no worries we're going to go back to the home so the house at the top you're going to cl click on that and it will take you back to this and you're going to enos you know design center just like we did before and now we're going to go to a another application another tool so now we're going to select home space planning which is at the top right we're going to go to block like we did with the other one and after going into blocks we're going to see some other furnitures you know you have your bed you have and in case you need to design a office we have desk and we have chairs etc but now we're going to use the bed as an example so we're going to double click on the bed and remember i told you you have angles so we're going to put this bed at a 90 degree angle so type 90 degrees press ok and just like the other one we slide our cursor over the page and click and that is how we release our furniture before we move on, I want to big up to all of my subscribers. Them you don't know what I love when you don't subscribe yet. The button is right there, so it's free. Just if you want to read something, say subscribe and you join the family. You don't know. And after you subscribe, you just go like it and share it. You share it to all of your friends and your family, brother, sister, auntie, anybody you see it. So now we are going to go back in our ad center because we are going to do one more furniture. and same thing just like how we were in this dialog box it's going to come up but if you don't want to go back straight to home and go back to this long process we can press the arrow at the top that goes to the left the back arrow and then it will just take you back to where you want to go and we're going to select the kitchen join 
to like block just like we did and that's where your kitchen furniture is or you have your cabinet you have your stove you have your fridge so now i'm going to show you guys a way how you can be creative and actually combine your furniture so i'm going to select a pipe and we have a sink so what i'm going to do is move this pipe onto the sink so you know you can have a sink where it actually look like you have to wash your hand in it with a pipe you know so select the pipe and select move type the word move and you're going to move the pipe all the way over to the sink and after i release this pipe i noticed that the pipe is not exactly on the sink so the pipe is above the sink so what i'm going to do now is select the pipe again and select move one more time and select the pipe and move it right onto where the sink is and now you have a sink that looks like a sink where you're going to wash your hand or do whatever you want to do in the sink not taking you guys through this process again but there are other tools there your app application the other furniture you can go to landscaping where you would find cars trees etc and this is basically the end of the video guys thank you for watching like comment share and subscribe if you want to know anything else please drop it in the comment section below again big up to all i'm a subscriber them you know stay best and give less my love you know